Well, hey guys, it's Dave. <clears throat> I'm about to go into my house, uh, my apartment, and I just had to uh, share with you kind of how today went. Today was a was a rather interesting day. I'd say it was kind of like a, a God day, if you want to say. Nothing huge, but I think um, it's kind of like the little stepping stones along the way. All that to say is, as, as you know, that I'm a bus driver. And as a bus driver, I don't have a chance to talk to the kids very much, so I'm concentrating on the concentrating on the road uh, but today there was a new young lady that was that joined the route and I had to find her house and all this and I asked one of the students who was my very first pickup normally to help me to um, to remind me that I was supposed to uh, pick up this this young lady in the morning because normally I'm just so tired I'm driving and I just completely forget all this to say is um, the student and I just started to talk and and I uh, asked him how long he's been in Evansville and he said um, did you just move here I said yes and long story short he asked the question why did you move from Florida to Indiana and I simply said um, to to start a new church and all of a sudden, his whole tone, you know, the whole uh, teenager, oh, yeah, I started church. and No, his whole, his whole demeanor changed. And he's like, oh, really? And we got into this story. And long story short, he asked the question. It wasn't me. I'm not allowed to ask any questions like that uh, or to tell anything unless he um, actually initiates it. So long story short, as, as he's interested, his father might be interested, his father might be calling me. Um, it, just, it, it was just a, a really neat thing how God just kind of uh, kind of put it all together. Uh, the second thing is I went to the University of Central um, Indiana, USI, and I started to do uh, for about an hour and a half um, after my last round, I just got done um, the spiritual spirituality survey, just uh, five questions about spiritual life. And I went around and I started to, to ask students um, questions about spirituality. And I just got back from that right now. And um, it's exciting that there are a lot of students that just don't know. They know that there's something out there. But they just don't know exactly what it is. They whether haven't been told or or the church baggage or whatever has kind of messed them up. All that to say, it's kind of exciting to know that there are students that um, don't exactly know, but they know that there's something. And we, as Catalyst Church, wants to be that 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 something that that directs them to Jesus Christ to to let them know that there is something in and his his name is Jesus and he, he loves you and he died for you and he cared for you and. and, and that's what it's all about. So I just wanted to share that with you uh, real quick. Um, God times and pray that as I go daily now to USI that I'll have an opportunity um, maybe even to share Christ with somebody. Uh, but right now it's just kind of like the survey and letting them know that there is going to be a church for them and this, that, and the other. Pray that God uh, clearly lets me know when um, to actually share Christ with somebody so I'm not um, being the hypocrite as they they already know Christians are. So I just wanted to share that. Keep us in your prayers. Love you guys. Um, that's a quick update. Bye.